the way things set up, those two center backs sonnet a holdover from a year ago. And now Virginia's tried some different things with that back line in the early going. And now Frowen has to retreat. She's not going to get there. That will slip in for one of the longest goals I think I've seen. Let's have. It's been Virginia possession heavy, as we expected coming in. Speaking of which, Doniak gets it back from Schaffer. McKenzie unloads towards the far post. Ratcliffe there to clean it up. And Virginia leads 2-0. 2-0 Virginia, but Millar looking to add to it for Ruther. Now Colaprico, quick passing, but Ruther, who is out ahead of the play, retrieved by Cruz Coast, keeping it alive, feeds in front, tapped by Ruther in, and Virginia storming in front to the 3-0 lead. On. Now let's go. One on three. Can she make a move and send it towards the net? Yes, she can. The number's not in her favor, but it doesn't matter. Veronica Latsko with an impressive finish and the fourth goal of the first half. For complete dominance. Speaking of dominance, Cole Abrico slipping it ahead for Doniak, looking to play it around. Kinsey over her head, and it somehow finds the back of the net. Are you kidding me? Cole Abrico, a long lead feed for Doniak, who flipped it over. Latsko turning, firing. Off the crossbar. No rebound attempt there for Ruther. Old Dominion puts up two shots in total to Virginia's 29. And we'd like to think that tells the story.